All right, guys, so this tool is called a capacitance tester. So the way it works is it actually sends voltage through the battery, and then it measures how much voltage comes back through the battery. And it takes that information, it calculates um, the health of the battery. So in order to use this tool, we need to know what type of battery it is and the battery's uh, rating. So this battery is a lead acid battery. And the rating, if I look at the label, uh, the cold cranking amps is 540 cold cranking amps, okay? It's a 12 volt battery. So this is the Matco Tools model MBT300. Most of them function the same way. The prompts might just be a little different, okay? So we simply take the red test lead, attach it to the battery. The black lead goes to the negative side and then our screen comes on. Our first prompt is asking us if the battery is in the vehicle. So we can test this in the vehicle or out of the vehicle. So we're gonna select no, it's not in the vehicle. So that's the plus sign. Next thing it's asking us if it's a 12 volt battery. Okay, so we have a plus, we'll change the voltage, a negative will change the voltage, um, or I can hit the enter key and it'll get, let us select 12 volts. So if I hit enter, it selects 12 volts. The next question, the next thing it shows us is the state of charge. It's telling us this battery has a state of charge 12.6 volts. Okay, so that means is this battery good to test? Yes, yes, yes because we want at least 12.4 volts or higher, and then we can go ahead and perform our tests. Okay. Um, once we know that the state of charge is good, we just follow the prompt on the uh, right corner here. I hit the plus symbol, and uh, I want to test the battery. If I hit the plus or minus symbol, it'll scroll through the menu. I could test the starter, I could check the alternator, and there's a couple other functions. So I'll go ahead and press enter. It's asking me to enter cold cranking amp units. Uh, if I hit the plus or minus, it'll give me different units. Different continents use different units. In the United States, we use cold cranking amps. Um, so I'm gonna hit enter, and then it's already set for 600 cold cranking amps. My scale says, uh, excuse me, my label says 540 cold cranking amps. So I'm going to hit the negative or the down key until I get to 540. Then I'm going to hit enter and then it's going to start testing the battery. Now it says testing, please wait. It says this battery has 88 cold cranking amps. So even though the voltage is good, it's not capable of producing enough amperage to start the vehicle. So this battery has 16% uh, of its capacity and it's telling us that we need to replace the battery. Oh, so when the cold cranking amps are, are down, that means the battery needs to be re replaced because it's Right, because just because the voltage good that is good, that's one thing. But it has to be able to deliver enough amps as well. Okay. okay. Any other questions? All right. So then when you're done, uh, you can go ahead and press the plus symbol, and it gives you the option to review the test. And, uh, and then this tool has a feature where you can print, print the uh, test results.